Hey everybody, welcome back. Rod here with some more Shadow of the Tomb Raider. So we are on our way to the final challenge tomb. If I'm correct. I don't think there's any more after this. So let's see what they got in store. Pretty creepy looking, that giant uh, skelly boy up there. <clears throat> Looks like we're going underwater. I was wondering, I'm like, there's got to be another underwater one. Oh, here we go. Oh, man. So what I do, he's just kind of hanging out there. Went past him. So there's no point in dwelling on it. Just keep on keeping on. Ooh. A whole lot of time underwater. Whoa. Might be a path underwater. You always know when you reach the challenge tomb because it spikes and shit everywhere. Let's see what this says. Maya God is very dark brown, almost black, with black rimmed eyes and facial features that seem to be melting at their extremities. Ooh. This can only be Exua. He's the patron god of the cacao bean, which accounts for his coloring. Also, because ancient Mesoamericans used those beans as currency, Exua became by extension a god of merchants and of trade. Interestingly, when he first appeared in the law, he was a god of conflict. Huh. Okay, that's pretty interesting. The Coco Have to God. Drain the room. Almost sounds like the name of the episode, The Coco God. What do you guys think? Hey, yeah. Is this supposed to be one of the beheaded gods of the underworld? Whoa. I was just guessing, I did not know that was going to be what I had to do. That's some like homage to old school Tomb Raider noises. I like that. We were watching Jack Sept guy play, uh, it was like a bunch of games in one video. And one of them was a Tomb Raider. Tomb Raider 2 game? What the awesome. Well, that's gotta be the way out. Right. There's survival cache here? The hell's that at? Oh, it's on the other side. Oop. Yeah, so I think that's how we get out of here. So we just go this way. Oh, we're gonna slide. Piranhas. Jeepers creepers. Hey, we know what piranhas will do. They destroyed me earlier. Uh, where do I gotta go though? Oh, there it is. I see it. Like the tiniest little crack. <coughs> hmm, excuse me. The tiniest little hole in the wall. Go up. Why aren't you going up? What the hell? I'm not gonna lie, that kind of almost scared the hell out of me. Alright, so we just gotta cut this. Snip. And then we can upload on it. Oh yeah, big brain. Yeah, Jack was saying in the episode he wanted to play Tomb Raider 2. He's like, I have no idea to play it. And I was like, oh man, that's sad. I still have my copy, so I could test play it again. I just gotta hook up the original PlayStation. 
I should, I should open on the PS3. Let's put it in there. I only have one skill point, so we just can't get anything out. That's okay. What happened to the music? That was weird. All full up. Can't carry okay. anymore. Can't carry anymore. Consensus of not being able to carry too much. Wait, wait. That went up. Oh, whoa. This is incredible. Holy cow. That's almost like Asian in a sense, like themed. So it kind of made me think of. But not really now that I look at it. So that's what I'm going for right there. Have to find a way up. Oh my. Piranha City, yeah. The piranhas are feeding on the corpses. Oh no, get out, get out, get out. <laughs> What's this do? Pulling won't keep the gate open. Okay, so that needs to be attached to... Have to find a way up. Something. We need to chop that, so let's uh... Oh shit, no. Alright. Nope, I'm dead. I, li I don't like that you can't fight them off. <laughs> They're all just hanging on. Have to find a way up. That's hilarious. Um. Wait, can I like, light the bodies on fire? I don't know why I thought that'd be a good idea. Up. Um, man, I don't know. There's piranhas everywhere. I need to swim to the other side, though. <laughs> Have to find a way up. Okay, sweet. All right, there we go. I wasn't sure. I'm like, dude, they just keep following me. I'm not gonna be able to go anywhere. I well, we can't do anything with that, but we do know. Okay, that's not gonna work either. Have to find a way up. What if we do this? If the frogs are up there. They might not see me. I'm all the way down here. Uh huh. Don't know what that does. But still does nothing. Does we need it over there? It looks like. Have to find a way up. Oh, there's another one. Shit. I'm just blind. I did not even see this at all. Okay, okay, okay. Now we're starting to make some sense. I think we can jump off of this and do something. Have to find a way up. I don't have, oh, <laughs> like I don't have any ammo. What am I supposed to do? A doy. Yeah. Impossible. I yeah. can't carry any more. Let's see. I remember seeing this over here. I was like, this has got to be something. We got to be able to do something with this. Maybe lower the water. Push. Hopefully, that's going to do it. Oh. I was wrong. Ooh, T. Serrano, testament. I am Truilo Serrano, and these are likely the last words I write. Andreas Lopez, or Angel de la Cruz, as he has called himself these last years, has finally and fully gone insane. His demands have grown, becoming more grueling and grotesque as we labor to build his crypt. The construction is almost complete. I know I will die when it is done. Lopez, mm -hmm. in a brief moment of clarity, told me himself. Damn that box. Damn what it has done to the man I once, and sadly still, admire. Yeah. 
level. Oh, that's not really good. The little water level. See? It has been lower. Can we go up this way? No, okay. It was layered, so I didn't know if like maybe we could climb it or something. Um. Ooh, that's not what we want. like the only thing I can think of is to make it fill up like halfway <sighs> that was annoying all right finally make some progress I was like I'm missing something here man I assume what we're gonna do now is just climb up Oh yeah. An Alux, plural Alashob, is a king to the Maya version of a gnome or leprechaun. They're about as high as an adult's knee and wear traditional Maya clothing. They are created whenever a farmer builds a little house on his property for them, after which they'll help the corn grow for a period of seven years, making it rain and chasing off predators. They're usually invisible, and in spite of their benefit to the land, they like to play tricks on or frighten humans. Don't call one by name, or you'll summon it from its home, and it won't be happy with you. Huh. Oh, that doesn't sound good. It's always such little percentages on these things we've been finding lately, like getting level 3. That's rough. There we go. <laughs> Alright, see that wasn't so bad. It was just that one part. I was just dumb. Sad face. Last one. Tomb Raider. Achievement unlocked. Now to get out of this horrid smelling place. <laughs> Charge arrows deal more damage against armored enemies. Ooh, sweet. I could use that earlier. That's it, you guys. Last tune. Last tune. Oh, I didn't think to grab this stuff. I still don't know how I was supposed to get that item down there. I tried to get it and it wouldn't let me. I feel like we could drain the water more. I mean, it's just a survival cache, so it's not that important. I mean, I guess you want the percentage completion good. But I really don't feel like diving all the way back down in there just for a survival cache. So, bye bye. Whee! Ugh! I should be close now. Close to what? Mm, excuse me. Don't fall on the spikes. That would be bad. Oh 
gross. Yeah, I was like, um, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> That's where we got this sneaky boy right here. What's that last challenge tomb? So we'll have any more of those unless if that's the DLC. I still haven't checked any of that out yet. But yeah, that's it, you guys. Whole episode on the challenge tomb. <laughs> I kind of figured it would be. It usually takes me about that long to finish one. So yeah, I got the achievement for it. So all we have left is to do a crypt, which I might look for that, but I don't know. I think we'll go ahead and continue on with some story. See what else we got going on. Yeah, thanks for uh, tuning in, you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed all the challenge tombs being complete. They're all recorded, so if you guys need uh, any reference on how to finish the puzzle, check out my videos on those. I need to, like, find all of them and put it in a playlist so that way people want specifically that they can see it. <sighs> but yeah, we, uh, we will go ahead and continue on with the story in the next episode. Thank you guys for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed. And yeah, hope you guys have an amazing day, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.